Hello friends! Welcome to today's video all about my favorite online school tips. So, let's get to it! But before we get started, make sure to like, subscribe, and check out me at my Instagram and TikTok if you guys are interested in more content. But we shall begin now. My first tip is to change up your study space. For example, you can sit at your desk one day and then here I'm sitting at the couch. I don't really recommend this position though as it's kind of uncomfortable, but you get what I mean. I know that sitting in one place for a long time can get you extremely exhausted, so I just recommend refreshing it up and getting new places to sit. I swear by this next tip, which is watching lectures at two times speed. You can honestly just change it in most of the videos you watch, and you can just get double the stuff done. So next is time blocking. Use this to plan every single task you have to do, and if not every single task, just a general outline of what you have to do every day. And don't forget to turn on those notifications so you never miss the lecture or any important meeting. Next is doing assignments as soon as possible. Most of my assignments I get can be done pretty quickly within relative fashion, so I just recommend doing it as soon as possible, get it out of the way so you don't have to worry about it later in the week. Next, listen to some music. I know there can be lots of distractions when you're at home, so if you just put in some earbuds, you can just block out everything and listen to your favorite playlist. Next is having a virtual study group. I know that studying alone at home can be very tiresome when you don't have anyone nearby, so that's why I recommend starting a virtual study group and having your friends there to motivate you along the way. And honestly, from what I've learned is that Google is your best friend. Just Google anything you have, any question about the material. And speaking of the material, I recommend reviewing everything before you have class. If you review the material beforehand, such as taking notes, flipping through the PowerPoints, the entire lecture just becomes into a review session to strengthen the information that you just read. And this is super great for time management as you don't have to spend time reviewing the information as much after class. And lastly, put a timetable in front of you so you don't have to sit there thinking what class do I have now when it's just right in front of you. If you don't already have one in front of you, here I have an editable Google Doc so I'm going to link below and you just merge the cells for each class time and you can always change the time on the side and then you fill it with a different color and it looks pretty nice I would say. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to check out these ones here and stay tuned for my video next week. Bye bye!